Here in Michigan, when the ragweed pollen typically starts flying, about 23 million Americans are allergic to ragweed. And if you start to sniffle and seize in late summer, late summer or early fall, you might be one of them. Well, it may look innocent enough, but a single ragweed plant can produce more than a billion grains of pollen, which can travel for hundreds of miles. So if you're suddenly sniffling and itchy, think allergies. Because of the way allergy cells work, when they're activated, they secrete itchy chemicals. So that's one way, sort of a, a rule of thumb of is allergy present, as opposed to a viral infection or a cold is how itchy are you? Ragweed allergies can cause an itchy nose, throat, and eyes. Sneezing, nasal congestion, and watery eyes are also common. Dr. Alice Hoyt, a Cleveland Clinic allergist and immunologist, recommends three steps for ragweed relief. First, use a sterile saline spray to rinse pollen and mucus out of the nose. Second, use an over-the-counter nasal steroid spray to reduce inflammation. Finally, Hoyt recommends taking an allergy medication. And the third step of it all is an over-the-counter antihistamine. And we recommend the newer antihistamines because they're less sedating than some of our older antihistamines. Allergy shots and immunotherapy tablets are also an option for long-term ragweed relief. So I couldn't just come on here with good news. I have, I have <laughs> yes, to of course. With some bad Ragweed is an issue, and if you are allergic, you know this, yes. until the first frost, so we're just getting started. With we it. are. A lot of people don't look forward to that first frost, no. but then many Some people, people do, because yeah. they really need the relief. Yeah. Thank right. you, Ben.